Okay guys, what's up? Welcome to Millijoule. The camera's doing the same thing it does every morning. Could be five minutes, could be 20. Oh, I heard it click. Good morning. Hello. Look who's here. I am here. It's my wife. How you feeling? Are you ready to be here every day? <laughs> no. Why not? <laughs> I don't know. It beats working every day. It does. Did you see my new door? Yeah. Look at that. J Max says, Miranda. <laughs> Bulldog's here. Good morning, Bulldog. Darren, what's up? Patrick is here. Darren is here. Dean is here. All the people. All the people. <laughs> Darren says, That's some red hair. This is your guys' first time meeting Miranda. Not the last, by a long shot. She's yeah. gonna be here all the time. All the time. Soon. Very soon. Like three months. Mm. Ah, you got your coffee? I have my Coke. Burak, good morning. What a name, Burak. That sounds like a Space Ghost character. It'll be way better than seeing your mug all the time. <laughs> that's fair. That's fair. I accept that. I think that's okay. And that's okay. Red Bull. Eddie Jones. What's up, Eddie? Good to see you, man. Guys, look at my new exhaust system. You can stay. You don't have to climb. But I want to show. Look at look at this. <laughs> well, let me just... I'm going to focus past you for a second. So Jimmy came... And my hoses are like a billion feet shorter. So like I'm getting really great draw on the CO2 now. The fibers is really short. And he installed a door. Look at this. Oh my God. There's a door. Fresh air can come in. I'm really excited about that. Except it's loud because you can hear the fans outside now. But. Uh. How neat is that? All right, all right, go back, scooch. Uh. So what's up, guys? What do you got? What do you have on the? What do you have on the? I don't know the schedule agenda. today. The agenda. What are you working on? Who's gonna be hanging out for the? Supporter live stream later. Are you guys going to be here for that? Oh, hey, Brent's here. Good morning, sunshine. Anyone else having the audio feedback issue? That doesn't sound good. What is the audio feedback issue? I don't know what that is. Let me I see. Don't I don't know either. I hear a hissing sound. Everything looks fine in OBS. That seems okay. This seems good. Are they hearing the laser? Are you hearing the fiber <laughs> laser? Because it's on. The fiber laser is running. Are you sure it's not the fiber? It's pretty loud. Just the whirring sound of a fan thing. I mean, the fan is on too. I'll turn the fan off. Really? Yeah, it's just aluminum. It's just aluminum. No that's, big deal. That's the fan off. We'll just inhale a little aluminum. It's just a little aluminum. <laughs> Bulldog says, my new lenses you told me to get just cleared at customs. Woohoo! It's going to make a big difference for you, dude. That wasn't it. Might be the laser. I mean, the the fiber laser is running. Oh, you were hearing me twice for some reason. You joined the Discord group. Nice. Yeah, the Discord group is amazing. We love Discord. Discord's almost as cool. It's almost the coolest place you can be. Almost. There we go. All right, I'm usually looking over here when I'm talking to you guys in chat, and I had it on this monitor for some reason. It's freaking me out. Oh, did you like the new podcast episode about tentpole sales and marketing? 
That was a pretty good one. What are temple sales? Temple sales are it's marketing that revolves around like an increase and then decrease in like searching. So like you have let's illustrate because I know even after the podcast some people were confused. <laughs> So here's Christmas, right? And as we lead up to Christmas Day, the search terms for gift ideas peak, and then after Christmas, they go down. It's called a tent pole because the thing is keeping the tent up. It's a tent shape. Get it? That's why we call it a tent. It doesn't actually have anything to do with craft shows and putting up tents to work at a craft show. That's what a lot of people think. It's actually a marketing term. So you 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 ramp up the search terms and then the search terms ramp down and they happen every year. Christmas, Valentine's Day, Halloween, back to school. All of those things are temple events. And we just uh, published an entire podcast episode on the Laser Source podcast on that topic. So if you haven't listened to it, go listen to it. Uh, it's a, it was a good little, uh, it was a good little episode. We also uploaded the Yeti Dog Bowl episode today, which is sitting around here somewhere. The bar is done. Yeti Dog Bowl. These came out really nice. Uh, so we do all of this with the fiber laser, no touch. So we didn't, uh, we didn't mark the metal at all. We just removed the powder coat with the fiber laser. No rotary tool required. Uh, pretty pretty good little episode too. So that's another thing you can go watch. And uh, lastly, you can go watch the like Patreon supporter live stream, which is going to start in I don't know soon. It's technically supposed to start at 11. We'll see how long Millijoule <laughs> goes today. But um, I'm basically going to be doing this all day. We have. It's going to be a lot of Q&A and just kind of hanging out, guys, because I've got 30 of these that I need to do. Two sides, two sides each, um, and we're on 13. So. Out of how many? 35. Mm. Yeah. So uh, that's going to be a thing that we have to do. We have to finish. So. Oh, and not to mention... It'd be one thing if they just dropped off a bunch of bars, but they didn't drop off a bunch of bars. They're in the box, so we have to get them out of the box first, which is just like already a nightmare. Then they come in this foam wrap, so we have to get them out of the foam wrap. And then they're in paper. Then you can engrave the bar and then you have to pack it back up. So <laughs> did you find anything bigger? <laughs> yeah, no, this is the biggest one they had, unfortunately. So this Probably is what we had to what? stick with. This five is a, feet this tall? is a five foot tall yeah. beam. Five feet tall, extruded aluminum. They're hollow inside. There's nothing in there. And uh they're for like some crazy science expedition. They're like deep sea monitoring sensors go inside these or something and they're being serialized so uh wow we need to catch up on chat uh great podcast great podcast thank you thank you um oh isaiah loved the bowl episode good dude i'm glad to hear that someone asked if you could do it on co2 this no this no. The bowl. could you do that on co2 the dog oh the dog bowl yeah they would be easier on co2 
Um, because you can throw as much power down at it as you want, and you're not going to mark the metal. Uh, and you should be able to get enough power with 40 watts or higher to be able to get around the curve without the rotary tool. So CO2 would be easy. Uh, we did the fiber because it was a little more challenging. Uh, slow, boring, but money in the bank, dude. Yeah, it is, uh, and that is true. We'll try to make the live stream interesting today uh, after Millijoule is over. Uh, Steve Barden is here. What's up, Steve? Good to see you. Yes, they're aluminum. They're just, it's just plain old-fashioned extruded aluminum. <sighs> they really don't want any dings. No, they don't. And uh, luckily, I've got my fiber on a big enough desk that they can just be kind of laid out. So you just toss it on there, and it. I don't know. Uh, there you go. You know, we 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 have room, so. You know, uh, uh, initially, initially the guy came and asked me to do this in like five different sections per piece, but he changed his mind when I quoted him $200. So we got it down to just one spot within the four by four area of the 110 lens. Uh, so that's what we're doing today. Rick says, hello, boss lady. Hello. <laughs> As long as you can lower the CO2 bed enough. You can. I tested it, actually. So uh, you have just enough clearance. You actually have to push the nozzle. I can't really show you right now, but you have to push the nozzle, like, way up as high as it'll go on that nozzle adjustment for the, the height of the nozzle. And then bring the bed down as far as it'll go on the standard red and black. And then it'll just barely kind of fit in within focal distance of a 2-inch lens. So uh, you can just get away with it with a standard Ruida red and black like co2 laser ah. mm. when's this baby coming i don't know she didn't say it to send me a save the date she should have <laughs> sent you a save the date that was rude of her who's ready to meet the uh the newest little laser everything helper me i am <laughs> yeah i'm sure you are ah uh, well uh, unless you guys have any other gossip or anything else you want to talk about, then I can go start preparing for the live stream. Have you mentioned your uh, new membership option? I haven't mentioned it yet. Um, you can check out the Laser Master Academy in the description, but I am going to do a whole like announcement video about it so that I can show it off and stuff. So if you want a sneak peek, if you want to be really, really early on the bottom floor of something brand new, you can check it out. Top link in the description, Laser Master Academy. But um, more info to come on that because I want to I want to do like a like a intro video Aye. where we show all the features. So um, place an eviction notice on the belly. <laughs> My. Bro had a baby boy yesterday, says J Mac. Home birth, their fifth child. Oh my god. <laughs> my goodness. <laughs> They're brave. J Mac with the link. Thank you, J Mac, uh, for, for passing that on. Go check that out if uh, if you haven't already heard about it. There is some pretty dope stuff going on. And uh, then it gets another 90 days in most states. What? Oh, about eviction. Oh, yeah. Mm, eviction. Noted. Uh, she does not get another 90 days. No. She will be forcefully <laughs> evicted uh, if need be. Mikel says, uh, hi from Spain. Hello, Mikel. Darren has five kids, too. Crazy. You guys are crazy. I hope to be that crazy. I, was say, that's I aspire. Exactly what you want. I know. I aspire <laughs> to, to be that level of crazy. All right, guys. Well, let's wrap up millijoule for this morning we just kind of popped in said hi uh we covered the new exhaust setup very very lightly i probably will let jimmy make an episode about that that's more his realm of bullshit anyway uh and i gave you a sneak preview of the horribly boring live stream that we'll be doing today so we're gonna have a lot of time because these take 10 minutes each side to run so basically i'm gonna have 10 minutes at a time where i'm just sitting around waiting for my life to end. So if you want to hang out and chat with me today, uh, don't forget to go join the Laser Master Academy. Uh, JMac, just drop the link in the live chat or there's a link down in the description and that will get you in 
Um, though 90% of you guys are already supporters. Just looking at the chat, you guys are already there. Uh, yep, you can either, if you're already a patron, you can hop on Patreon. If you're not already a patron, you can sign up for the new Laser Master Academy, uh, which JMAC just dropped the link for. And uh, that has links to the live stream as well. And we'll get started. And basically just hang out. We're just, we're just going to hang out today. It's kind of going to be a hangout day. That's just, it's just the way it is. We got a big job. We got to get it done. So um, we'll do that. And we'll be, we'll, if we can grind it out today, we'll get back into the exciting stuff tomorrow. Because uh, we can do a live stream tomorrow. And probably one on Thursday too. Uh, and that's it. Yep. Thanks for hanging out with me. Talk to me. Yeah, I'm talking just to you. <laughs> I'm glad you were here today. Yeah. I can't wait for you to be here every day. Soon. We're going to get you comfortable in front of the camera. Very soon. You can teach tutorials on how to buy insurance for your business. I am not an insurance agent that sells business insurance, but... You, but you know more about try. it than I do. You know more about it than these people do. <laughs> I am a property and casualty insurance agent. Mm, that's just the one you pass the test for. <laughs> Uh, we are too. Oh yeah, don't forget to smash the like button. Smash <laughs> it. Smash it. Seriously, smash it. And uh, and leave a comment after the stream has ended. It boosts engagement and gets more people in front of Millijoule. I love you guys. Uh, if you're supporters, I will see you in about 20 minutes. And uh, have a... a what? <laughs> you the I'm going, I'm, we're shooting for a hard 20 minutes. We'll see what actually happens. It might be, might be 11... 15 uh but we'll, we'll be in there uh and i'll see you guys in a few uh otherwise i will see you for tomorrow's episode of millijoule have a great rest of your morning and i will talk to you in the next one bye see you later